given the last 18 months or so of the pandemic, you know, social isolation has been a real challenge, I think, for many people. And we know that we are a social species. Humans are social and that it's an important part of probably what does make us happy. And this is where, you know, hormones like oxytocin, for example, may play a really important role because we know that they're released and uh, influence our mood from social interactions and social situations. And so I think, you know, that's something that has been really difficult and perhaps people appreciate more how important it is to have close relationships or interactions with your friends and your family, but even just with, you know, everyday people, I guess, on the street, because it is something that, you know, we know is rewarding uh, and does you know trigger changes in chemicals like 5-HT or serotonin and dopamine and, and certainly oxytocin. Um, and so that's not probably something we would have necessarily thought of before as a life, important lifestyle uh, activity, but having, you know, good uh, social interaction but I think that is something more than ever we realize how important it is you know, potentially as important as having you know making sure you're sleeping enough and getting exercise.